name's Sophie, you're on 1700, and I'm joined here by Dylan Lewis, hosting, um, hey, how are you going, man? Good, thank you. Now, you are hosting tonight's gig, Star Tunes, the Starlight Foundation. What, what, how did this gig come about for you? We, we know a teacher at the school who's organising it, and uh, he requested that, that the man choir that I'm involved in might like to come and sing, and then it just turned into me doing some hosting as well. Because <laughs> those shambles didn't turn up. <laughs> <laughs> Fill in host? <laughs> yeah, I was second on the list. <laughs> so, yeah, you're also singing tonight. Looking forward to that one. Now, you're involved in a lot of different areas in the media industry. How did you um, come about this band in particular? Manquire. Choir. Um, man choir was... Uh, most of the things I'm involved in in this media industry are an accident. Man choir is an accident too. In 2002, uh, I got married to my beautiful wife, Holly, and all our friends can sing, so I asked them all if they could come and sing at our wedding, and, and they did. They sang some beautiful Stevie Wonder, and then that worked so beautifully that we thought, let's just keep doing this for fun, and that was back in 2002, and so we're still doing it for fun. We meet weekly, um, we have a little bit of a sing, and it's nice and pleasant and good for the soul, and then recently we've started branching out into the world of doing gigs, and so we've done a couple of weddings, and... That's about it. <laughs> gigs, gigs are good. Now, um, so you're saying a lot of um, stuff that that comes about is by accident. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, you're in. You're doing radio. You're doing um, TV. What's your What's your true passion? It, it's always been music. Um, I got into TV through music, I suppose. Um, I didn't plan on getting into TV. Again, an accident. Uh, that, that when I first started doing TV, it was a show called Recovery, a music rock and roll show, um, which I'm sure you watched when <sighs> just you were a little tacker. I did, I did. I want to talk about that in a minute. <laughs> yeah, and, um, and so uh, the reason I got that job was uh, my then girlfriend, now wife, uh, filled in an application form, said you should go and do this audition. I said, what is it? And then she said, just turn up, and I accidentally got the gig. And then from then on, it's just been rolling on from there, I suppose. Got a few other little TV gigs here and there, and now doing radio, loving that, and that's that. Accidental. Yep. It's kind of the dream, really. I know, I know for me. So, um, Recovery was an amazing show. I mean, our, my generation grew up with it, but it's, um, it's not to be anymore. I, and our show, 1700, is aiming to do a similar thing. But do you think there's, there's, it's lacking in, t in today's um, television industry? Most definitely. I, I've missed Recovery being on. I've missed being involved in that show, but also I've missed having a show like that on the television. So, 1700, go sick. You're the next generation. You'll be the new recovery. I've heard from people who know stuff that indie and rock and live music is the next big thing. We're all sick of miming. No one wants to see Britney mime anymore. Well, they do. They're all going to go. But they don't really want to see her mime, do they? <laughs> so you, if you're ready for it, I think you need to be there to be the next recovery if you can. I think I'm ready. And I think that means that maybe one day I'll be hosting a Star Trek's gig. <laughs> Well, now, um, what are your plans now? I mean, it seems like you're covering a whole lot of different bases, but what, what are you working on now? Um, I'd like to keep my job at Nova 100. I really enjoy doing that gig. I've always wanted to do radio. As a child, I thought one day I'd like to do radio. Studied teaching, didn't be a teacher. Thank God. Um, <laughs> But yeah, I just love radio. I want to do radio forever. But anything else that comes along on the way, I'm, look, I'm happy to give things a try. So if more TV comes up in the future, yay. Maybe I could get a job on 1700 if you'll have me. Please do. Then you can teach me, maybe. Teach then you me. Then um, you can spread it further. Well, we hope to see you in more programs. I mean, with the spread of media on, online and everything, mm. who knows what's going to happen. But um, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Absolute pleasure. High five me. Yes. Ah, so strong that one. Oh, uh, yeah, you know it. <laughs> Thanks. I've uh, been Sophie on 1700 with Dylan Lewis. Peace.